Here we go on the political front as usual. <coughs> Interesting stuff. Um, first of all, I noticed uh, something uh, that was posted uh, saying basically that uh, both neo Nazis and uh, you know Jewish backers of Donald Trump believe that he's going to you know he has some sort of secret agenda for them. You know, it was he's on their side. But this is a phenomenon of voting, especially when you declare you're a candidate early, you don't go through the whole thing, is that since you've declared, it's almost like you say, I'm with this person, you know, to the end. I'm not going to change no matter what. No matter what the evidence is, I'm not going to change. So you're vested in your original thought, your original well, thought that was manifested into your words that are now in the universe and they will come back either to haunt you or to help you or to something you, right? So that's, that's one thing. But here's a, here's a funny thing that I find. Um, Hillary Clinton uh, had said earlier, some sometime a couple of weeks, a few weeks ago, that uh, she was would, would be agreeable to um, how do you say uh, debating? If we call these things debates, when you get these 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 mainstream media people doing their little question and answer thing, uh, debating Bernie Sanders uh, before the California uh, um, primaries, which is I think uh, the seventh of June or the sixth, of, some sometime in June. I think it's the seventh, Prince's birthday. Well. Anyway, uh, but she's backed out. She's done what I call the classic chicken hawk thing. She's a coward. She cowarded out. That's what chicken hawks do. They don't. They don't engage. They they go through their uh, surrogates or they do something else because they don't want to be a part of the battle. They will send people into battle. They will ask people to do their bidding. They will rig the situation so that you know they'll come out on top no matter what but they will never ever engage in direct battle. They are not the generals in charge leading the charge like in the, in the, in the old, old, olden days, right? They're the people behind the thing and says, oh, let me just look at that screen, let me push that button or they watch some sort of action when it's happening and say, yay, we got them. Yay, we got them. But you were sitting in some office, you know, thousands, tens of thousands of miles away talking about we got them. Come on now. But here's the funny thing. So Donald Trump, who's, look, give it to the boy. You know, he's slick. I mean, he's slicker than slick. You know, for whatever reasons, he just getting over, right? But he says that, uh, uh, yeah, he'll, he'll debate Bernie Sanders and Bernie Sanders pays something. There was something back and forth, and then he got on some late night show and said he'll debate Bernie Sanders. Then Bernie Sanders supposed to have said, sure, let's, let's get the biggest arena possible. We'll have our debate. In other words, Donald Trump versus Bernie Sanders. Wow, that is something to see. They will have the highest ratings ever, I am sure. And, uh, and the chicken hawk will be out someplace at the TV corner. Ho, 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 you know, see how that goes? So. Uh, if this happens, I will definitely be tuned in wherever I am on the planet because I'm traveling in a, in a week or so. I'm traveling a bit, so I don't know where I'll be, but I will tune in to see the, to see the whole thing from beginning to end. Donald Trump versus ben, Bernie Sanders in a big arena, and all the profits paid basically go to charity. That's what that's, that's what they say. It's not going to go to anybody. Any, you know, it's not going to go into Hillary's pockets or anybody else's pockets. Okay, so this is going to be fun. I love this political season, and I, I'm going to the States in about a little week and a half or whatever have you, so I'm not being a mist of it. I want to see what's really going on from the, you know, from the inside. And for the inside, look it out, rather than from the outside here, like chicken hawks, looking in. Uh, that's, that's what I'll be doing. That, that, that would be me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect. <laughs>